What was concluded in uh, Geneva last night is not a historic agreement. It's a historic mistake. It's not made the world a safer place. Like the agreement with North Korea in 2005, this agreement has made the world a much more dangerous place. I know that many share the concern of Israel, especially in the region, and there's a reason for this. For years, the international community has demanded that Iran cease all uranium enrichment. Now, for the first time, the international community has formally consented that Iran continue its enrichment of uranium. And this is in direct contravention of UN Security Council resolutions. Iran is uh, taking only cosmetic steps, which it could reverse easily within a few weeks. And in return, sanctions that took years to put in place are going to be eased. Iran is going to receive billions of dollars worth in sanctions relief. So the pressures on Iran are being lifted. They're being eased. And with the lifting of this pressure, this first step could very well be the last step. Without continued pressure, what incentive does the Iranian regime have to take serious steps that actually dismantle its nuclear weapons capability? Why would it dismantle the centrifuges and the plutonium reactor? Well, Israel is not the only critic. Some